Supercharger Showdown and Money for Cat uh, Tribute. Um, I'd like to recognize the family, and I don't know all of the family members. I, I've been working with, uh, of course, Mo, Julie, Sherry, Jenny, Bear, Little Bear, and the rest of the family and crew that are here tonight uh, sharing this experience with us. Um, and for, for all the family immediate and extended, and when I say extended, I'm talking about everybody that's in this uh, raceway tonight. Uh, thank you for being here. I do want to make a couple of special thank yous uh, for, uh, goes out to Jagger Naves from Earth Shaking Entertainment. When Jagger heard that we're doing a tribute to Bunny, he immediately contacted me, what can I do? Now Jagger books a lot of shows with a lot of the cars that you're going to see here in just a short. And he put out the call for all of his network. And we have over like 22 or 24 cars here on the property. Have some that were broke just the, the last races they ran. But 30 originally came out, said that they would be here. Now these drivers tonight came here to make runs in honor of money in front of you. No, no guaranteed money, no fee, no, but just out of sheer love and respect for Bunny uh, Burkett. So I want to give, while we can, a big hand to all these drivers that came, spent their hard-earned money to be here for you tonight and to honor Bunny. What a heartfelt, uh, Chester there, I mean, that is absolutely right. You know, that happened one other time with regard to Bunny Burkett at Bud's Creek. Many, many years ago, after she had one of her accidents, we had a Bunny Burkett race where we were gathering money to help her pay her bills, and we got a call for all the big racers in the Northeast to come down and support it. And I'm walking through the pit, and there's none other than Frank Manzo, the man of all time. And I'm like, what are you doing down here? And he says, it's the bus. And these guys are carrying on that, that tradition. Thank you, guys. Uh, we also had some uh, sponsors uh, uh, to actually put up some prize money after the fact. After these guys have already committed, they stepped up. And we've got awards, cash awards, going to um, best uh, low ET, high mile per hour, long distance award, low, uh, and best reaction time. But most of all, we got money up for the best money burnout each round. What was her signature uh, uh, here at Maryland National Raceway, as well as around the region. So I want to thank S and W and the other sponsors for that. And if you want to know how I feel personally about money and what she meant to the racers and fans here in this region, as well as around this, uh, this track and around the country. Next time you go to the diner, just look up. There's only one racer that gets the honor of, 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 of being here, and that was how I felt about Bunny. And uh, that historic IHRA World Championship car will be displayed uh, proudly for many, many years to come. Uh, the car was painted and originally put on the roof 13 years ago. So Mother Nature has taken its toll with the sun and and uh, part of tonight, Barney Squires from Ultimate Garage 
has donated the labor to go back to repainting the car to its original glory. They'd be up here for everybody to enjoy for many years to come. This is a lot of stairs. We want to thank that. And, like Bill said, every ticket you purchased tonight, you did buy a ticket, right? Every ticket you purchased tonight, a portion of that goes to the family, the charities, and the materials to do that car out there on the, the repaint the car. So when you look at it next time, you were responsible for that. So thank you. Barry, Buddy was a very talented and competitive driver to be sure, but she was the consummate showman. Her signature eight mile to thousand foot burnouts and historic flag waving as we see it up here uh, was signature Bunny. But what made Bunny so special and loved by the fans here is the time she would spend with each and every fan at the back of her trailer. Every fan would meet her and have it, they were like the only one there when she was there. And uh, many nights I have spent here, the race is over, we're securing the track, and it's time to turn the lights out and go home. And My battery is going dead. I'm going to make a part two. So make sure you watch the part two and like and subscribe.